Hey everybody, Body7 here and welcome back to the channel with La Liga Startup Squad. Yeah, it's we do have a Navy Free, yeah, it's not a mistake. We do have a Navy Free in there, but let's start. Uh I would go with this goalkeeper from Valencia, Marmar Dashvi. Eh? Did I say that right? I don't know. That's a weird name to say. Very bad nation, but if you go in here, and this is the most important aspect. You're going to see his almost two meters high. And again, like we did for the Prem, we need we need very tall goalkeepers. Then Traore. I think people will go towards other players because there are faster players with better nation links than Traore. Uh, there's a lot of fast Spanish players, uh, for example, for the right back. Uh, so I don't think people go for uh, Traore. I think you should go for this one because he has a good, good pace. Defending is good. Like I mentioned probably on my English uh, Premier Premier League team, you probably need to uh, put like Hunters and Shadows on everyone. That's the first at the start of the game. Then Haido, I've always used this guy in starter teams from the last two FIFAs, I guess. Because his pace is okay, he, he has great defending. Just don't try to shoot on Don't shoot with him, he's very, very bad at shooting. But 88 physical and I'm just gonna I really want to see this now. I want to show you guys if you come here like 91 strength at the beginning of the game you will be pushing people aside very very easy you basically don't need to put anything on uh, on physicality you just go with a, sh a shadow on him he becomes very fast he's the 84 center back at the start of the game that's very good that is actually it's a shame about the defensive awareness but still then I went with Luis Philippe again. Uh, there are faster, well, the nation is good to be honest, but there are faster players. But this will do the job. Then Espino, that's the same thing. There are okay, not faster, but as fast as him. But because he has uh, a bad nation and the team is not the best, I think he might be cheap. So again, the shadow on him is going to become very fast. And the most important thing, because I assume I didn't play the beta. But every year it's the same, you just pass the ball to him to the line, go to the front, do a cutback and it's a goal. That's usually like this, that's the idea of these players and I think this one won't be as expensive as the others. Then you have Kubo, Kubo here, um, let me check something for, yeah, four star week, but that's what I thought. Um, Kubo, this guy is supposed to be a wonder kid, I don't know if he's still a wonder kid, but he is fast, he has some decent shooting. And his nation sucks. Yeah, his nation sucks. But this is good because there are players with the same stats as him that will be more expensive because of the nation. So focus on Kubo and I don't think you will be disappointed. The same that we did with the Premier League. Like two CMs, but then you can change how you want to do it. In this case, you can put Robert Holm as a cam and Drak Dar Darder. So I was going to say Drak Slav Darder as a CDM. Um, or you can play like this and it's really important that you have one with the defensive ability and another with some uh, well decent fast to join the attack uh but yeah i think robert Tom will be a bit expensive because he had a really good card last year at least his special cards were good Darder, i'll be honest it's gonna be a little bit more expensive because of the nation uh the, um, the pace the pace is gonna be a very big factor and last year his card at the start of the game was really broken I think people will run towards this card again, but I have to put this one because there are no other good defensive mids that I've noticed at least. I don't focus that much to be honest, but you know what I mean. Then Maxis, as you've noticed, there's a trend on this team. It's very poor nation links. Uh, I don't want the biggest nation links because that's going to be a very big factor. Again, there are other players, but I can show you guys so you understand that I'm not exaggerating so lm let's go with lm as you can see he's an 84 right uh, 84 pace in this case because he should be around on here uh where is he where is he here 86 76 look fernando torres 83 79 he's going to be expensive because he's a barca player gomez 84 76 going to be expensive uh, Argentinian player and usually has good uh, his body type is very good but he isn't in anymore then you have uh, Bamba 
good nation link is link good nation link is really good but you see less by 70 in 72 pre shooting but he will be uh, more expensive than marquis for example and this is like an example I, I know what i'm telling you guys because of the nation link because it's from venezuela he will be very very cheap and then for the strikers i went with sadik and uzuni again very bad nation links but with the hunter they can become um, actually good let's go with this one with sadik if you go with sadik you see his uh, shooting stats drop a lot because of his long shots and volleys but let's say you put a hunter on them yep. hunter see in 91 pace 82 shooting composure sucks i know but um, you just need to tap in some balls and uh, let's go with uzuni here and we're going to put a hunter on him just to show my point uh, you see 90 pace 85 shooting 891 striker he's going to become really good at the start of the game remember this is all at the start of the game but uh, yeah this is the besides darder uh, i think all of the rest is going to be very accessible at the start and i personally think that investing for example in uh, maxis at the start of the game is a very good shout out because people will start to understand that this card is actually uh, quite 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 decent but anyway that's my prediction for a good starter team what do you guys think do you like this theme would you improve what would you change to think like let's say uh um marmar does really it's going to be more expensive because of his height just give me your opinion at the comments down below okay please leave a like a comment hit the bell icon you know all those good things that make us grow sub button over there my, over there should be my marquee matchup prediction video and over there is my platinum channel where i put completion stuff i'll see you guys on the next one bye